Hey everybody, this is Bob. So we are now starting chapter four, or part four of my Cow Cow Kessin 2 2018 playthrough. Battle of Cheng Bon Po. So, here we go. Following his victory at Cheng Bon Po, Cao Cao remains in the area, waiting. Cao Cao's plan is to join forces with his valiant general, Zhang Liao, and strike both the Jin province and Sun Quan's kingdom of Wu. Let the meeting begin. Everyone lay out your ideas. A lot of the farmland in this territory has been turned into wasteland from lack of cultivation during the war. Let's increase the harvest yield by rounding up refugees to work the land. Let's tell Liu Bei's soldiers that if they defy the mandate of heaven, they will suffer heaven's wrath. Liu Bei's army will be consumed with fear. <laughs> Both Wu and Jing province are powerful enemies who will be difficult to defeat. Our troops will need more training before they can return to battle. Sire, what do you wish us to do? So I'm going to pick probably training troops. I want. I don't understand why this guy's so maniacal. And then hers are not good. <laughs> Training seems like the best option by far. So, yeah, I'll just pick that one. <laughs> I don't really know if that's the best thing or not. The training program is finished. Our soldiers are now well prepared. Receiving a report that Liu Bei's army has fled to Jia Ko, Cao Cao launches an invasion of the Jing province without waiting for Zhang Liao's forces. In an attempt to finish off Liu Bei's army, Cao Cao himself leads a pursuit party. They approach Liu Bei's main unit. Zhu Niu, summon Yao Chan from the capital. My lord, is Yao Chan all that you can think about right now? Just go get her! My lord, you have changed so much. Why are you only concerned with what happens to Yao Chan? She's just a common prisoner. If you push her enough, she'll tell you where to find the Imperial Seal. What? Did I ask for your opinion? Do you? Tell me, are you serving me as a warlord or as a woman? I must know the truth. Speak to me now! I will, I. I am a warlord, not a woman. My lord, my lord, the rest of the north has been suppressed. Oh. Ah, Zheng Liao. I'm relieved to see you back. Zhu Niu, prepare for the war council. Yeah, she totally wants him. All right, well, you're now hitting up the war council, so I'll be... It seems that Liu Bei and his troops are trying to escape to the territory of Sun Quan. In order for us to win this battle, General Liu Bei's unit must be forced to retreat at once. But if Liu Bei succeeds in getting to this point, then we will definitely lose. If my lord has to flee, then we will lose as well. State your strategy. Please listen to my humble strategy. If we all take a roundabout road, the danger is that the enemy might slip right by us. What I think is, you should enter the forest over here. If we split off and attack Liu Bei from here, he will be hit from both sides. I think this would be our best strategy. My lord, I think we should do precisely the opposite. Let's avoid the forest where we could be trapped or ambushed. 
Instead, let's attack in two groups like this. My lord's main unit breaks through here and waits in ambush for Liu Bei. Lord Zhang Liao's detachment will break through here and attack Liu Bei from the rear. With this strategy I have devised, I think we can certainly defeat Liu Bei. My lord, which strategy will you have us employ? So I am leaning by avoiding the forest. I might still bring one of my units through the forest in case there's some experience to be had. Like, I'm assuming there's landmines and crap, so yeah. Here we go. 